Jackpot Weather, presented by Valley View Casino and Hotel. Well, we are all waking up to these uh, rainy conditions and some really intense rain beginning to pick up here in Hollywood and for many of us. So over the last 30 minutes or so, uh, this is the heaviest rain that's moved through. Again, the dark greens, the yellows, oranges, and even those reds, that is very heavy rain in a short period of time. We have seen some snow falling in those mountain communities. That's at the pink and purple show, and we're getting a little bit of a break for part of Orange County right now. Not the case, though, for high desert communities. Mountains also seeing some snowfall in San Bernardino. County Inland Empire heavy rain for you as well starting to lighten up though and then through parts of Orange County into San Diego County still seeing that heavy rainfall but this is the band that is moving through right now that will bring us a very heavy rain in the next couple of hours so it's why we have a flash flood warning in effect for that box in red which does include Glendale Long Beach here in Hollywood Beverly Hills Westwood so a lot of areas uh, if you're just waking up to this just know there is a very heavy rain to come and everyone else in green you're under that flood watch until tomorrow at 6 p.m. So even though we are going to get significant breaks today and tomorrow, the threat of thunderstorms is why this flood watch has to stay in effect because those who do see those thunderstorms, you're going to see a very heavy rainfall in a short amount of time, which has a likelihood to cause some floodings. So rain for everyone right now. Temperatures in the 50s again dry right now for Orange County that will change over the next couple of hours. And as this system moves through, notice how these winds have really started to pick up the per Purples, that's the strongest on here, and that's what we've been seeing through those mountain communities and will continue to for the next several hours. But Orange County, very windy conditions for the next few hours until probably 10 30, 11 o'clock. So we do have a wind advisory still in effect for you until 11 a.m. You see the tan shaded area for the Antelope Valley, though that one expires at 9 o'clock this morning. This is what we can expect for the rest of the afternoon. This is the highest resolution model we have. It only goes out about 16 hours. So just to give you an indication of uh, what we're expecting for the rest of the day and this is what's coming through. That's the reason we're under that flash flood warning. It does last several hours as you can see by about 9 10 o'clock. We'll start to get a break for LA and Ventura County and then that moves through Orange County, the Inland Empire and we continue to see the snow falling in those mountain communities. Notice how we see nice dry conditions for part of the afternoon, but the potential for seeing heavy rain moving through and some cells moving through uh, that is in the forecast, which includes thunderstorms that would come along with in addition to the rain, gusty winds, hail and of course lightning. So no surprise a winter storm warning is in effect until 11 o'clock tomorrow. If you are not already in the mountain communities, a good idea to not go there until this storm passes. We are expecting again. It's an atmospheric river, so significant rain, although these won't be exact. This is pretty close anywhere from a one and a half to two and a half inches for most of our coasts and valleys, mountains one and a half up to four inches and this is from the time this started last night until Sunday night. So just know that we are expecting to see significant rain with this system. Now on these seven days, you're going to notice the chance of rain by the end of this coming week that if it brings us rain, which there's a good shot right now, it will be light. Nothing like what we're seeing today and tomorrow. So San Fernando Valley low 60s, well below average today and tomorrow. Showers and thunderstorms are likely that heavy rain, though, about to pick up and will last for the next several hours. Slight chance of still seeing some showers on Monday, warm and dry and sunny for Tuesday and Wednesday and then look how quickly we cool off by Thursday as that next system moving in bringing us the chance of rain by Friday and for the Inland Empire 55 degrees today rain and thunderstorms in the forecast again that heavy rain over the next few hours it's about to pick up showers and thunderstorms also still possible and likely for Sunday could see some more light rain on Monday you'll also dry out Tuesday Wednesday Thursday look at the temperatures from Wednesday to Thursday and then Thursday to Friday a good shot we'll see some more rain by the end of next week and we'll be back after a quick break.